Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Fableheim in our beloved governor's ascension to the Jinn dynasty. Before I end our turn, you can see Luji has assumed command of this army, and we're replacing a few units, putting in a Dao Swords Guard and a Crossbowman because we're lacking a little bit of um, armor piercing. And this oh. army has a little bit of armor. So that's the plan. More armor piercing, good. In Shangyong, well, first things first, in Chang'an, you can see this jade mine has been pinging me forever because we lost the trade port and thus lost entrepreneurs. But over here in Shangyong, we are upgrading the merchant warehouse to give us entrepreneurs. Problem solved. We also uh, put Lu Ji and our beloved wife, Zhong Li Zhu, over here for assignments. We do want them both increasing our silk income, but unfortunately, Sima Wei holds on to that. And he's going into ambush. Good. We know he's going to attack. The question will be, do we think that our injured army can take it? Or do we sacrifice the silk trader, let him take it, and then kill him? Hmm. Yu Yingshu would like a non-aggression pact. Now, I would love to destroy Yu Yingshu, but unfortunately she is a vassal of Sima Liang, who is our good friend. Please take 600 now. Sure, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. That's fine. 600 now seems good. She probably doesn't make much per turn with a horse pasture. Sima Zhang commanded the vassal Zhu Ro to join the war against Yuan Shangzhen. Speaking of Yuan Shangzhen, I would like this farm, please. Attack! Thank you. Careful planning. We only lost 47. Victory. Good. Better cataphracts have something to this do with that. Will meet our needs. Sima Wei declared war on Zhu Ruo, and Bai Jin has been destroyed. Goodbye, Bai Jin. Lu Yun is energetic. Six instinct in camp and map movement range, own army. Ah, it's beautiful. Hey, look. Bai Jin. Wasn't your, your faction just destroyed or something? I think we recruit him. Honestly. We do have a few vanguards, but... Oh, he's his spouse. Tong Leon in the Sima Chi faction. Do we even know Sima Chi? Why is your wife in another faction, bro? Shouldn't she have come with you? So many questions. All right. So now... What do we do? We could... Walk outside the settlement. Let him take it. Does that benefit us in any capacity? I'm trying to see what the main difference here is between the axe bands and the Dao Sword Guard. The Dao Sword Guard just seem better. If you ask me. So put another one in. Another crossbow. I've never actually used the repeating crossbow, but I don't know if it's good. <laughs> Seeing the crossbowman has 50 ammunition, and I don't think that's true. I think it's the archers that has 50 ammunition. Excuse me? Oh, oh, that's not ammunition. Okay, that's not ammunition. The crossbowmen, the archer militia, have 43 ammunition, and the crossbowmen have 30. Wow, you have a lot of cunning, Lushi. But we have 50 range damage armor piercing. Compared to... Wow. They do so much more damage. Maybe we should just have crossbowmen. Well, they have less ammunition. I don't know. I actually don't know how it all works out in the end. But I guess we're going to sit there and wait. Oh, I should have gotten rid of you. How can I serve, my lord? Shin Yueon is our administrator for Wudu. We spawned her to give her a full retinue, and I should have despawned her to give us all of our money. Hmm, what are we researching, anyway? Reforms. Mass mobilization. Because we want this. Onyx dragons. Heavy repeating crossbow. That sounds terrifying. Roll suppression. Onyx dragons are awesome. Absolutely amazing. I love them so much. All right. 
Let us end our turn. We can take a quick look at diplomacy, I suppose. Although we were just doing this. We could peace out with Sao Juan. I don't really care about being in war with him. And Fan Shou, our ally requested we go to war with you. You really want this, okay. You have no ancillaries. I'm shocked. You probably don't make a whole lot of money. No, you make 333 turn. You have equal money to us. Alright. That's uh, not good. You will give us... You know what? Being at war with you doesn't really matter. It's not really doing anything for me. So we'll just take 192 a turn for peace. The other two we'll stay at war with. Alright. We peaced out with former Emperor Wu, and now... A moment of truth. We must fight for our survival. Against the forces of Sima Wei. Who I'm assuming is going to attack us. Yeah, okay. Shocker. A close defeat. Evenly matched close defeats. I'm sorry, what? What is this? Uh, do you have one too? No, okay, at least you're less geared. Well, this is terrifying. All right, I have a plan though. I have a plan. And it's Wise team up on people. And considered strategy will give us countless victories. Countless victories. I hope so. Because this is going to be the test. Our foes must be crushed. Absolutely. Do not it's give them time that we put them inch. in the grave. Whoa. All right. So we have a little settlement, it seems. Which means we probably shouldn't use fire. Probably not advised. They have a giant group here and a small detachment, smaller-ish detachment here. So, how do we want to do this? We're a little crowded, aren't we? Hmm. All right. So, first things first. Our cavalry are going to be a bit um adventurous. I don't think it benefits us at all to have them front charge things. So we're going to try and sneak around and. Maybe shut down some archers, maybe not, who knows. Who knows what's actually going to happen. What I do know is that we want our crossbows and our true spearmen away from the front. We want them to be reinforcing, shooting from the back, that sort of thing. I don't know how line of sight's going to work here. So hopefully, well enough. Uh, bows, you guys can come back here. I guess you can be here. Probably don't want the Dao Sword Guard up front, because they're going to take a lot of punishment. They're just going to get shot to death. Hmm. I guess you can come here, too. All right. We want all of our generals in the middle. The time has come. You heard him. You heard Luji. The time has come. We want these just guarding the entrances, but I don't think they're gonna... There we go. Do anything. No, 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 no. Go this way. I want you guys this way. What is this? Loose wench. Probably not the best idea. Are they all coming for me? Like straight through the gate? So it would seem... What are you even shooting at? I shall at? revel in your destruction. This seems fine. Do not waste your breath. You we might do need. fire shots until have been seen. Pass it. later. Stand like until they get closer. Right See if we can get some explosive damage Answer going. Ready. Now the key here is going to be using our abilities as well. Shi Shung has the Take melee evasion ready. buff. Lu Ji has the melee evasion debuff. And Fa Yi has the roar of the beast. This is a very powerful ability if used correctly. Emphasis on correctly. Also, I'm just going to go ahead and take a wild guess that dueling is off. 
ready. Limits. Stand ready. Blades ready. Our men are spotted. Show no mercy. I don't think Retreat. dueling is something we want to do. You know? Hey, look at this axe Ten. band. It's taking so much punishment. Attend me, Spearman. Cavalry. Stand ready. Okay, reduction to Swords. range damage. Blades. Prepare. Everyone's Swords. going in. Fury. Prepare. Shoe Spearman, we need you guys on the champion. Let's go. Everyone needs to turn around too. Cataphrax run. The enemy unit flees. What cowards! Take heed, warriors. Double time. Prepare. Alright. Move, move. Double time. Debuffs get ready. Water overcomes all. Ready. Hurry. Move. Here we go. Cataphrax need to keep running. Keep running, Cataphrax. You guys need to stay here, actually. Blue stay back. Okay, G, come out. Come out, come out, come out, come out. Good. We charged in Fai Yi. We debuffed, we come back. Keep poking. Continue the poke. The poke must continue. Now we've caused a bit of chaos back here. See if we can get our cataphracts around. Now the... We're being caught a little bit. It's okay. Go on, keep up. I know you can do it. Okay, we need to... Amazing that you can both talk and battle. We have a few seconds. Okay, keep shooting in here. I need all of your shots in here. Our men are running. The spineless cowards. Yeah, they can't be doing that. We need to keep. Where are my cataphracts? I need you guys up here. Seven. Four. Three. How many have you killed? Not enough, I think. Where are you? You're in combat. That's fine. your best? Maybe. Come on. Try harder. We might need to do this strategy. Where we let Fai Yi die. One of our generals has fallen. To buff Chi Shong. Okay, he's berserked. So is Lu Ji. This is not good. I mean, in... Okay, Lu Ji's out. Fall back. Shi Shang is being destroyed. Okay, shoot this way. I don't want you shooting that. Where are my cataphracts? Why are you guys not coming down here? Let's go. Shi Shang is fleeing. That's not good. Lu Ji, do not die. Please keep shooting this crap. I need you shooting into this. Fortunately, most of our front line is broken. I'm not quite sure why my cataphracts weren't coming to me. broken to me. Now, they're wavering. Oh, she's back. Okay, we definitely need to try and kill these guys. Crossbows need to keep shooting at important targets, like the Chu. How do I... how do I do this? I need to try and hit both of these guys with this buff. This debuff, rather. At the moment, I don't think I can. Cataphrax got caught again. It's okay. Kind of. She's wavering. Luji went in, but he needs to get out. <laughs> go, 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 go. These axe bend are wavering. Crossbow men are back. Ooh. I think we can kill this guy, but if we do, it's going to make him go crazy. I think we're going to pop it here. Just so we can hit the Chew Spearman. Okay, it's popped. She's wavering, but so are the sword guard fighting her. Luji is the trying to fight this guy. Falls. He's dead. Ah. This guy's berserk. Uh-oh. She did not get berserk. She's just high threat. But Luji might be able to say something about that. Oh. There you have Cav coming in. This is very close. We do have some sword guards. 
or saber in militia anyway that haven't done anything. I don't know if it's a good idea for you to fight this Luzhi, but we might try. Now the catapult's still shooting at the Chu. We've kept it online, thankfully. Where are my swords? This guy healed a lot. Oh, don't go in. Oh boy. I think this is a loss. Stand ready. Ah, it's so close. Unleash I think I can kill her. Move out quickly. Just need a second. Swordsman ready. Make ready. Attack. Okay, hold him. Take heed, Luigi will go up to her. Swords at the ready. The time yes. I need to hear his ability back them. though. To attention, archers. We need to try and get him into tower range. I don't know if that's gonna be possible. Catapult, this is like attack. point blank firing. Missiles. But I think it can be done. Fortunately, my ability is not back on forever. I think if she turns to hit him, he's dead. Come on, catapults. I believe in you. You're all that I can rely on right now. Fire! I don't think they're going to. It might be too close. Our men flee the battlefield to battle! March at the double! Come on, please. I, I don't think Stand it's going to. Strike. <sighs> Water this is so close. Wall. What does this ability do? Armor and melee evasion. Double time. Please fall back. Archers ready. Hurry. This... Fight. Okay, we shot Do a little bit at the Chew. Move. This might be it. Go, go, go. Oh, it's so Move. close. Ready. Damn. Move, what do we need to win this? Unleash fury. Let's see if Luji can kill her. I don't know. She has so much damage. They are overwhelming yeah, she's going to win. Goodbye, Luji. Luji. How much health? 941. Valiant. Defeats. That was so close. My cataphranks kind of like derped out there in the middle of nowhere. That was probably not good. Ugh. So close. All of them were legendary though. You would like my wooden fish for a thousand gold. Sure, whatever. Have my fish. I don't care, Simo. Anyway. Simo Wei, curse you! That was such a close fight. You want to join my military alliance? No. No one else wanted her. Expected gratitude? You've been at war with me since, like, turn two. No. Fa Yi was released. We lost the Silk Trader. The Jin Empire declared war on Song Wei. Ru on Shen signed peace with Song Wei. Yuan Shang Jin was liberated by Sima Wei. Oh. So technically we could peace out with her, but we're not going to. Can I reach this? No. That's annoying. For Harmon. When drawing a bow, Lu Ji. hold the breath. Let's see. Were you hurt? You were. You are scarred, which gives you two authority. And three more when attacking. Own army. It just made you better. It's alright, though. You did well, Luji. Capturing enemy officers. Chance of ambush. Those are both very good. This is also very good. We'll go down a little bit, because we want this to mess with other people, and we want this to increase range damage. Without its steep climb, a mountain cannot exist. Together, it's all right, Luji. There are plans to draw up. You'll come back stronger, Warriors better than ever. Fai Yi is so expensive. Maybe I should recruit you first. 
and Chi Xiong is intimidating. All right? Apparently, he wasn't very wounded. He is immune to. Oh, I thought that's an immune to scar effects. No, immune to scare. It's all right, Chi Xiong. Soon, we shall have our revenge. We will reclaim this. We will defeat Sima Wei. With each defeat, we grow only more determined. Hey, look, our entrepreneurs are back. Why are you... Resources required. Entrepreneur... Oh, we'll take a turn. We should have our entrepreneurs back. Everything should be fine. Is that the first? That's our first defeat. I think. I mean, aside from us obviously throwing away cities and audit resolves. Ah. Oh. Wang Jin formed a coalition with you on Shengshen. And then Sima Liang vassalized her. Sima Yue signed peace with you on Shengshen. Sima Jiang signed peace with you on Shengshen. Sima Lun signed peace. We signed peace. Regrettably, the Empress demands supplies too. The Empress's garrison is in dire need of nourishment, she says. She comes to you to exact this nourishment, demanding a large quantity of food to feed her troops. What do you say to this demand? I mean, we could afford to be in favor. We are heading towards this, slowly. I would really like to have that. I wonder why, well, I guess, I went over this last time, didn't I? Where I was like, I wonder why mind alignment reduces satisfaction, but I'm sure that a cultivator of opinions would <laughs> reduce satisfaction. Uh, anyway, do we have any spirit? No, we're cold. Let's pay for supplies. Keep heading towards that wealth alignment. Food is too precious to you right now, and so you offer money instead. The finest armor. Sweet, what do we get? Master's leather. It's a set piece. For China. What do we got? That's what we're wearing. Master's leather. Not particularly good. I mean, it goes to the battle axe, which we can get. 25% melee damage own army? Are you serious? That's insane. Hey. Samain, look what I found for you. An overseer. Increase campaign movement range. Campaign map movement range. Win leading. Guess what you're doing? Now. Well, win commanding, and he's commanding. He's also leading. They're the same thing. Cunning triumphs over brute force. This location suits our plans. It does. All right. We continue. We have com We have secured the commandry. Of Shangdong. Lu Yun and Shi Xiao are now Osworn, as well as Sima Ying and Lu Yun. Excellent. So we are only at war. Who are we with? We are at war with Sima Wei and Fan Shou. Sima Wei, you've incurred my wrath. First things first, though. So we have, we can get spy stuff. Not a fan of Increased chance of ambushing. Oh. Let's do this for more trade, and then we'll probably increase our ambush chance. Sima Wei has incurred my wrath. And perhaps we'll go north. Deal with him. Deal with the pest. We might find peace for a little bit. I can do this. Wait, who are you? You're not a vassal of anyone, aren't you? No. So we could... This won't actually do it, will it? This will upset the Jin Empire. Hmm. I'm thinking that we go to war with Xiang Chengli. Let's cancel our thingy with her. Oh, previously signed. Uncertainty breeds untrust, mistrust. Please don't take my jade mine. I'll be up there soon, don't worry. So we canceled that. That's like five or ten turns before we can go to war with her without penalty, which is fine. That gives us plenty of time to kill Sima Wei and then move over. 
So now I'm looking for the Jin Empire. Oh my. You have a lot of ancillaries. Now our goal here is to befriend the Jin Empire. As much as possible. And invite him into this alliance. Fortunately, he doesn't seem too interested. Zhang Hua is currently the ruler. Do we have any deals with you right now? No. That's why our thing is low. Okay. Well, do I have a deal for you? I feel like I should keep this. How much is this worth to you? Nine. Now, I don't know if I want to use this, but I feel like we should keep it. Because that set bonus is insane. I don't want this, though. I don't have any fish anymore. Hmm. I mean, I'm almost more willing to give up Spirit of the Dog than I am Master's Leather. And this set bonus is just crazy. But this is really good. Like, if we wanted to make a duelist sentinel, screw it. I think this might be a mistake, but we own the armor craftsman. So, you know, we might get more. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, immediately, not regretting it. No regrets. No regrets. None whatsoever. Okay, since this doesn't make you happier, I'm just going to milk everything from you. 2,030 gold a turn. Yes, please. Of course, we do need to find a way to make you like me more, but... Ooh... That was just good. Can I just give you money? Like, if I give you... How much is, will it take for you to go up one? No? I don't even know how much money I have. Alright, that won't just make you happy. Damn. <laughs> I was hoping I could just pay my way through. You know, buy my friendship. Well. We are going... To, we are waiting two turns to recruit Faiyi once again. He's coming south. Oh. He did not fully replenish. You think that you can take me on again? Sima I vassalized Mao Ren. Okay. Sima Yan requested Song Wei join their war against Zhu Ruo. And Sima Zhang joined in the war. All right. Living in harmony. While some would prefer to watch the days go by in placid harmony, others are determined to go forth and seize that sinking sun. A friendship forms of this boundless zeal, as two of your warriors for find companionship in their endless adventures. To watch them is exhausting, but heartening. Relationship deepens between Fai Yi and Bai Jin. All right. Our two vanguards are getting along. Now, we could bring in Baijin just so we have a full retinue, or full army, because somebody's getting antsy. Promote calmness. But I don't think that's really necessary. I think that we could take his wounded army. Maybe. Those three generals alone are horrifying. Not spending any money. No money. We need Fai Yi back. Oh, you're a little upset. Hey, I have a feather for you. Oh, wait a minute. That's with satisfaction. Well, sorry. Besides high corporate position. You don't have a one idea. Okay, he doesn't have a thing that increases his independence or whatever. It decreases actually. So how would you be as an administrator? I didn't think vanguards were very good. You come from commerce. Hmm. You do have zeal, though. That's a good one. For, you know, armies and stuff. 
25% melee damage for all shock cavalry. Oh my. Plains of the Phoenix. Yep. Yeah, I don't see much here for... Yeah. Actually, fight ye. I know you're a little wounded at the moment. My apologies. Charge bonus on retinue. Do you have that thing? There we go. You don't have zeal, though. You need a few points, Faye. All right, no spendy money. Smying. I think... Well, we don't have any enemies anymore besides Simoe, so I think he just comes and, you know, reinforces. What's the My fastest way over here? Deserves. Actually, go here. Always forwards. Well, this is still the, the fastest way, I guess. Design. All right. No money. No spendy money. Our tax level is already elevated and we're still fine with noble support. It is going down in a few places, but should be okay. Quick turn. Oh, we got a trait that I didn't check. No. Now, that's actually an interesting choice if we were to be vassalized to him, but currently we don't need it. I've used it before where, in my Kong Rong playthrough specifically, we went to war to a whole bunch of pe with a whole bunch of people, and we would just bend the knee to Yuan Shao whenever we were in trouble. Sima Zhao sent a peace treaty with Sima Chong. Yu Yingzhu requested their master Sima Liang to go to war with Sima Yan. Overpopulation is successful. Shi Sheng is a wee bit happier. Fa Yi is back in his army. Peace through conquest. So what does this look like? I want to go through here. Game. Oh, it looks like it doesn't like that. I wanted to go around. <laughs> but it's like, no, this is the fastest way. Don't go this way. This way is dumb. But I feel like we could hold there Hong Zhong. We can hold this. The wound, the army is wounded. So we just go backward through the back door with Smai. You know? Show kindness. Is this silly? Doesn't feel silly to me. Feels logical. Is this a road that goes through the mountains? Wow. I also feel like if I go this way with Samaing, the army that's here ambushing is going to see him and turn around and run really fast. I feel like going through here, though, is going to take a while, yeah. Hmm. I think I go this way. This could be really dumb. The game could be right. This could be a foolish mistake. Well, the game could be wrong. In China's name. This is taking way too long to decide. Just do it. Moving. Follow your gut. No matter how dumb it may seem, follow your gut. I know you're dissatisfied, although we did buy our thing. Oh. Never mind. Fortunately, I don't have any positions for you, Baijin. Ah, 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 no. Oh, he's built a, sec a second army. Yeah, this is dumb. I see what you've done. I see what you've done. He wants Shang Yong. I really don't blame him. Faction destroyed. Sima Yan. He did just have a bunch of factions go to war with him. Avoid diversions. Embrace impulse. What do we got? He's fleeing. Advancing. Oh. Oh, decisive victory. Mm, that's what I love to see. Now, I could just delegate this. This is a fleeing army. It's going to be destroyed. But I want to watch you die with my own eyes. 
We are going to be a little careful of the generals, obviously, but that doesn't change anything. We break their weakened forces. We surround them with the Chu Spearmen. We poke them to death. We debuff them. We chase down their infantry. And then we break their souls. Never get on the bad side of uh, the beloved governor. He will make you pay. Ooh, is this a beautiful... I keep getting lower to the ground. Yeah, I can. Look at that. Nice red sky. Trees kind of block it, but it looks good. All right, where are we at? Over here. Probably. I don't like fighting in trees. I wish you had Vanguard deployment. That would make me happy. Guerrilla deployment. Whatever it's called. All right, no. You're not group one. The time has come. Has it? Girl deployment just makes this so much easier. But it is what it is. Let's try and get a loose idea of what we're looking at. Yes, please stand ready. There is someone outside with more base than I think I have my entire computer. So if you can hear that, my apologies. All right. And you three get over here. I don't really care where. Just get over here. Do you want to go forward a little bit? Because I don't think they're going to come to me. Maybe they are. That seems really dumb of you. Guys, come here. We're going to fast forward, though. All right. Now, their heroes are the problem. They're generals. They're heroic generals. See? You lack the strength to defeat me. So we're not gonna duel. Your words are as pathetic as you are. We are just going to cheese it. We're going to stack people on top of people and slaughter them. Where are you facing? Now we are using fire arrows on our archers, even though it does less armor piercing damage. Okay, Luigi, stand back a little bit. Okay, Chu, where are you at? I need you up here. You guys need... Ooh, set that tree on fire. You guys need to poke. You need to poke well. Alright. We're going to suffocate here, but... Oh, no, you're the wrong person. Ooh, they're fleeing. I guess this is the best spot for it, isn't it? Debuff. Buff. Luigi, come back. Bai Yi. Here we go. We're surrounding the champion. Our militia are dealing with the archers. I guess they can shoot there too. Yes, we will. Okay, I think we killed the commander. We're debuffing. We're being very aware, <laughs> very cautious of Li Liu Shen. We used the morale breaker over here. Look, look how powerful that is. That is just ooh, a game changer. Where are the cataphracts? They're right here. They shouldn't be. Fighting Chu Spearman is a bad idea. As Liu Shen is about to find out. We're going to come over here and use our ability. We're going to kill Liu Yingfeng. Because I want her weapons. Basically. There she goes. Cataphracts, I need you out here. Fai Yi, please come back. We are using most of our ammunition. That's okay. It's meant to be used. Oh no, you guys come back. The mounted cab broke. We are being very weary of Liu Shen. Just incredibly weary. We can use our debuff soonish. We're just pulling everything in. Victory. 
All right, cataphracts, chase him down. Kill Liu Shen. Avenge our defeat. Break him. The enemy general falls. Ha! Well done, gentlemen. A close victory, which is worse than the AI said it was going to be, but we killed them ourselves. I was actually surprised that it was going to be a decisive victory because the generals are so influential. Down he goes. A quick wit dodges the hardest blow. They needed more than a quick wit. We've gained an axe. We have captured Liu Shen for executing our beloved friend Gu Yan Yan. I shall present your head to our governor. An unfortunate consequence of war. Take Keeping mighty. them is a waste <laughs> of our resources. Marching. Let us continue onwards. Actually, no, you need to turn around. <laughs> Chi Shong has leveled up. Now, Chi Shong. Oops, that was the wrong button. Court. Is our Chancellor. So, faction wide effects. Yeah, see? It even says so. So, faction wide effects are good, is what I'm getting at. Do we have any other ones? I don't think so. Hmm. I do like this one, but you don't have any charging units. So we'll grab Diligence. That's a good one. It increases uh, bonus experience for units per season faction-wide, and it gives melee evasion for melee infantry own retinue, which are these. Guess. Actually, I think it should affect the Spearmen as well, right? Or is it just the Purple Dudes? Wei Gui has leveled up. We are using him mostly for assignments at the moment. Which I guess is why we're heading this way. I've never been a fan of commanders, but I've also never really tried to use one. I want your horse. <laughs> Just jack the man's horse. You are a senior officer. Yeah, you can have a promotion. Why not? That will only increase the satisfaction plus 10 for a few turns. So Samaying is heading this way, and we need Luji to sprint this direction to set off this army. Tis the plan. Now Han Zhong, we will eventually get this Silk Trader back. So what do you want to do? I like this. At first I wasn't sure how I felt about this unique building chain, but we can build this everywhere and get noble support and food and increase peasantry income. It's actually very good. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Probably one of these two. Not the school, the inn. Hmm. We could build the Confucian Shrine. I like this a lot. The um, Yellow Turbans has something like this. This one gives research rate and income from all sources. Maybe we don't need this yet. Let's just build the inn. This is a pretty simple noble support income sort of buildy thingy. It's kind of like the workshop, but for commerce. Let's just build it. Let's go. Bashi. I want to upgrade this. The weapon craftsman. This just increases your chances of getting items, I guess. And we want that chance to be maximum. Now, I want to talk to you guys about Ba. Not the sheep, the area. We cannot complete that commandery anytime soon. Do we increase food or do we increase money? Good question. How extreme does this get? 2% food production, 100% income from peasantry, 150, 150. You know, 150, 150 is fine to me. We could use Ba as a huge bargaining chip with Yuan Shengzhen. I will summon my cancel in just a moment. So like if we... Oh no, I can't ask for her city. If we offer this, it's only worth 14. 
I'd rather give this to someone else then. <laughs> but as I was saying, if we use this, we can do a whole lot of things. It doesn't even make you happier. What? Red Stallion. You know what? Fai deserves that. It's not worth giving this to you. But it's just a thought to keep in mind. Because we can't complete the commandry, we could give it away. Or we can just keep it to generate food. Chishong and Lu Ji are now O-sworn. Look at all these auxiliaries. So beautiful. All right, Fai. There is coming. You've done well. These are your rewards for doing well. For performing. A stone rat. Bookkeeper. Do we actually have that? No. You know, bookkeeper is not what I expected an ancillary with instinct on to give. You know? We'll give him an axe so that he can ask people a few questions. Now, Baijin, I think we'll give him this. Give him a little more satisfaction. All right. Let us check on this. Overpopulation. I like how he's just giving me the same thing over and over again. Makes it pretty easy. And predictable. We are researching another trade agreement. Unfortunately, I would love to have trade with the Jin Empire. Which is why I think Xiang Zhangli is the next faction in our sights. Yep, I knew it. He wants revenge. Sima Yong would like me to become his vassal. No. My greed? Your greed? These people. How can I become regent? Oh. Wars declared. Escalate. To an alliance war. She shouldn't have done that. We're probably going to lose the Jade Mine, though, so that's a thought. War. Tiger, tiger. A tiger is prowling. A tiger prowling in the camp panics the gods. The screams awake your general, who leaps from their tent half-dressed and wrestles the beast to the ground until it is properly subdued. Moments later, another tiger's roar is heard, but it turns out to be the contented snores of your general coming from his tent. Inspiring presence. With wisdom. Of course. Chi Shong inspires all. On the march! Now that I'm looking back at this, this does seem to be a little foolish, but I think we can make this in one turn. I think we can. In which case, all worth it, right? Hashtag worth. We could increase this. What are we looking for here from Bashi? Peasantry is kind of our main thing. I feel like this is not doing me much. Like, this would be better served as something else. Getting rid of it. I'm going to increase the mail post. I mean, we don't really have any commerce besides the mail post. Maybe we increase the farmlands. This seems like a good idea. I like food. We are currently sitting on 18, which is increasing our peasantry income by 12%. And our reserve Sima way is being rude. We did get our new trade agreement, so I need to look at that. I want this. Let's get our chance of ambushing first. I do love me some proper ambushes. Now trade. Who wants to trade? No one wants to trade. Well, it's probably more accurate to say no one can trade. So, yeah. That was a quick turn. We are continuing to replenishment as we move across our territory, so... No force marching. As Sima Wei is doing. Yeah, take the lumberyard. Do it. See what happens. Simi Yue would like my clay warrior and he's willing to give me now. I need to use that for some sort of useful diplomacy. Simi Yue. Yue, Simi. Regardless of how you vote, majority of your allies have already declined this deal. So she immediately... Zhang Zhang Li. <laughs> so she declared war on me. I invoked an alliance war, and she's like, nope. She just immediately noped out of it. But too freaking bad. 
Sima Jiang left the coalition of Sima Yong. I can't move while this is up. Suo Yingming declared war on Sima Yong and the Jin Empire. That's probably a mistake. Independence declared from Sima Yong. Oh, because she was declaring independence. Okay. A question of character. You wander across two courtiers, locked in heated discussion. Compassion, one argues, is the most meritorious virtue, whilst another insists that righteousness should drive all action. You ponder their reasoning as they look to your opinion. Now then, we could side with Baijin, which we probably should do. Oh, but your might alignment. Bro. Bro. What is this? I do like prestige. Flip a coin. You settled the matter with a coin toss. Unfortunately, the coin rolled away and no one saw the results. <laughs> That's a good way of dealing with that. Now, the reason I did that is because we are 10 away from wealth alignment, which increases our income from all sources. All sources and gives us Not a trade agreement. Possible. This army is going to get crushed. They do have four true spearmen, though. That's kind of alarming. But, uh, yeah, you're going to get wrecked. Be still. The Wudu Copper Mine. Shot, Yuri. Now, that is a pretty alarming garrison, but uh, we're just going we to them. crush them, it looks like. Good job. This location suits our plans. We're coming. We shall reclaim all of our territory soon enough. Lu Yun. We want... You're not commanding. We want zeal. We want zeal and charge. Chargey thingies. Disciplined. He'll give faction-wide faction support. That's pretty good, actually. Wait, do you not have any chargey thingies? Oh my goodness. Lu Yun. I'm disappointed. This is charge speed on retinue. But he doesn't have like... Mm. Wow. Wow. I don't even know what to say. Well, you're not commanding. I guess we'll take mobility and grab zeal, but I'm pretty disappointed in Lu Yun's... Uh talent tree here, if you know what I mean. She shall. you deserve this horse. You do. You're a good man. Let's see if we need anything to upgrade before we end today's episode. We've done a lot. What is this? Oh. I'm not spending my money to upgrade that, but we should figure out what we're putting there. Probably... I'm not sure yet. We could put a temple there. I do love me some temples. Baji... We could upgrade the city. You know, let's do that. And in the next episode, we'll be fighting over Sheng Yong. The Lumber Guard's only level one, so good luck, bro. Good freaking luck. Han Sheng. Boom. So, thank you all for watching. It's been a bit of a roller coaster today. But in the end, we always win. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed... And that you look forward to the continuation of our beloved governor's ascension to the Jin Dynasty next week. Bye-bye.